Actually, that's funny, Coach. We wanted to ask you about Justin Brownlee. I mean, you know, I've had a chance to work with him twice in one of my in my teams, and then you've won so much championships with him. But just out of curiosity, you've faced so many imports, and you've also coached a lot of great imports. Where does he rank up there in the all-time <laughs> PBA imports list? Really well, tough. I mean, it's, it's so difficult. I, I hate, you know, every time I get onto a pro, they're always asking me to rank this or rank that. Uh-huh. Or because the problem is, is that you're always leaving somebody out, you know, <laughs> um, especially over 30 years. I got a lot of imports to rank. I got imports that I don't even, I was going through these books, you know, uh, and I was looking, I was saying, God, I don't even remember this import. I had that import. I didn't even remember his name. I mean, I've had so many imports over 30 years. I, I, be interesting to see if Fidel uh, McGonan could could figure out how many imports I've coached in my career. Uh, has to be at least a hundred. I mean, yeah, for sure. Hundred. But uh, so it's always difficult to rank. But you know, the the top two uh, are, are are pretty obvious, um, and I, I think that you know they they rank in the top uh, list of of all time PBA imports, and that's uh, Sean Chambers and Justin Brownlee. Um, they are the top two. And it's interesting because their approach to the game is, is very, very similar, but their personalities are, are polar opposites. As you know, Justin is extremely quiet. Yep. Uh, he's, he's a giggler. He likes to laugh, and uh, he likes to hang out with impo- uh, his teammates, but he likes to laugh with them. And, but he doesn't lead conversations at all. Uh, on the other hand, Sean is, is, is like me. He's a gabber. You know, he talks and talks and talks and talks and – He's always creating the jokes and then laughing at his own jokes and, uh, and people laugh with him and, and uh, he's just so much fun to be around. Justin's like so comfortably around to be around. Sean is like the, the, the life of the party type of guy to be around. But the approach they bring to the game, um, the unselfishness, the, hum, the humility and uh, the seriousness and practice, um, and the leadership of, of other of, of leading by example is is almost you know they're they're exactly on the same narrow path. Warning on Coach Paulo Layug for delaying the game. Technical foul on Coach Anton Altamirano for resentment to a call. Coach Charles Chu out of the playing courts. Coaches unfiltered. No refs. No techs.